Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Lab Within, where I talk all about self care, skin care, and healthy living. If you're interested, then keep watching. As much as we take care of our uh, skin and our body externally, it's very important to also take care of them internally. What we eat uh, is also uh, important uh, for those of us that uh, have a skin condition like rosacea or acne. Certain food uh, is trigger my rosacea and it will irritate me all day long. That's the worst uh, feelings to have. It's like your skin is crying. Once my skin is happy, then I'm happy. Today, I'm going to share what I eat in a day to keep my skin healthy and free from rosacea irritation. I hope that you guys enjoy and find some inspiration and some uh, healthy meal ideas. Uh, first in the morning when I uh, woke up, uh, I fill my bottle with warm uh, or home temperature water and adding some lemon juice. Uh, then uh, I drink a bit first thing in the morning because uh, it makes me awake and it makes my digestion system going and keeps me hydrated and makes me feel very good. Uh, today I will make some oatmeal. Oats are among uh, the healthiest grains on earth, especially in winter time. It's nice and warm. It's comforting and filling. Uh, they are source of important vitamins, minerals, fibers, and antioxidant. There is nothing bad thing about oats. I pour half a cup of oats on a boiling water and cook it. You can add milk as well, but I don't really like milk. Uh, I just cook it with water. Uh, and just uh, some drizzle of honey to make it a bit sweet. Uh, it's done. I will add some mixed of seed. Uh, this one is a, a mix of uh, chia seed, hemp seed, and flax seed. Seeds are uh, nutritious, uh, loaded with antioxidant, fibers, and protein. It's really good for you. Uh, I'm just adding some cinnamon powder. Because cinnamon is one of the most delicious and healthiest spice on the planet. It smells so yummy. I also add some walnuts for some extra crunch. Walnuts are also rich in antioxidants and healthy fat. Then add some fresh berries. Blueberries, raspberries, uh, again full of antioxidants, vitamin C, and they are nutritious and importantly, they are anti-inflammatory, means it won't irritate my skin at all. I will have this with a cup of green tea. And I'll see you guys at lunchtime. I make a quick salad for lunch. Uh, this is just a mix of leaves and top with some cucumber and cherry tomatoes, uh, avocado and boiled egg. I make my own homemade dressing. It's very delicious and very healthy. All you need is one lemon, uh, two gloves garlic, and a bit of a ginger. Uh, ginger is option. One cup of uh, ham seed. Uh, also, you can add cashews uh, if you don't have uh, ham seed. Uh, and some fresh herbs like uh, basil or parsley or cilantro or coriander, whichever you have it will work. And then some water and a bit of a apple cider vinegar. Mix them all in the mixture.
dressing makes the taste of salad to another level. Highly recommended. For dinner, uh, my sister uh, cooked uh, tonight. Uh, she made a delicious soup. Uh, it's a veggie soup. Uh, it's one of my favorite soup uh, that she makes. It has potatoes, carrots, celery, barley, and chickpeas. It's full of nutritious and full of vitamins and minerals. After dinner, uh, I love a good cup of green tea. I drink my tea plain, uh, but I do add to my tea some fennel seed, uh, which is good for your digestions, and some uh, cardamom. Then I will have them with some dry plum. Dry plum is good for you and sweet enough not to eat any bad sweets. Well, in my video here, uh, hope you guys like it and find it helpful. You don't have to exactly follow what I eat, but just to give an idea of healthy meals. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!